wake up call after wake up call is coming to the WWE. Like, this is kind of long overdue, but I feel like now is the best time to talk about this. Fox, you know, SmackDown and Raw are moving to Fox in time. And uh, Fox reportedly wants SmackDown, I hope he's not just talking about SmackDown, I hope he's talking about both SmackDown and Raw, to be less politically correct. <laughs> in other words, they don't want them to be PG anymore. But let me read this article to you. Fox wants a more edgier product from WWE. WWE is set to move their SmackDown Live program to Fox this October in a new Friday night. Oh, it's going back to Friday night too. I didn't know that. Uh, well, actually, I, I still don't know whether or not Raw is going to Fox or not. I hope they are. Uh, according to Raha.com, I think that's how you pronounce that, Fox is reportedly asking WWE to make changes to the content once the blue brand makes its way to the network this fall. <laughs> the report states that Fox is looking for a more edgier product from WWE and wants to move away from their ca catering to the PC culture. Yeah, I really hope that does too. Here's what they say. The sword says acts that Fox is also looking for a WWE product to be a more edgier product that they are looking to give into the PC culture that dominates current WWE programming. I agree wholeheartedly with that. WWE toes the line and attempts to be careful not to offend or upset any group of people if the company decides to bring back more at your storylines. They could face backlash from a segment of the fan base as well as the advertising partners. Yeah, I think that that fan base might be the soccer moms that watch WWE today and they don't want their kids to be exposed to the horrific, you know, blood stuff. If, if, if they ever, you know, bring back blood, I really hope they, bring, they make the blood fake because, you know, there's a reason they got they got rid of the blood back then. It's because of risk of hepatitis C. Yo, the blood that they used was real blood. They bleeded themselves, and that puts them at a risk of hepatitis. So, I really hope that if they were to bring back blood, it's fake blood. Anyways, <clears throat> if this change does happen, one one can only speculate how this will affect WWE programming outside of Fox, as well as pay per views on the WWE network. I, all I gotta say is, if they offend any group of people. Too bad. A lot of shows that are, that are still going on today on TV have offended a lot of people. Like Family Guy, for instance. They've offended a, they've offended a lot of people, yet Family Guy is still alive today. And even SpongeBob has offended a lot of people. A, a, a show for kids. It's had a lot of adult innuendos and stuff that, is, that has offended adults, too. Yet that show is still alive today. <sighs> Moral of this... This is a huge wake-up call. Another huge wake-up call for Vince McMahon. But I don't care if going back to TV 14 offends a lot of people. Because that lot of people are not true WWE fans. They're just a bunch of soccer moms that, that complain that they, they don't want their kids to be exposed to stuff, to stuff that's TV 14. Newsflash, WWE is not supposed to be for kids. Wrestling in general is not supposed to be a kid show. Why, why would you think that a show that involves people beating the crap out of each other like that, and, and involves blood too, should be allowed for kids? Didn't you ever think about that? That's not what WWE was originally supposed to be. I really hope. I really hope that Vince McMahon is scared about this. I really hope that he is. I really hope he is. It will... I want to drown in the sweet water of his fear, if he is. I really do. And yeah, before before I close this video out, I want to say, there are people that come to me, you know, whenever I make certain videos about a certain topic, WWE is a prime example. Some of my subscribers do this. Uh, they come in and comment saying, well, I don't know what to say. I don't watch WWE. I'm not a wrestling fan. Listen, I'm not trying to be mean about this, okay? But I'm just saying, if, there, if there's a topic that I talk about that you're not interested in and you don't know what to talk say about it, you don't have to leave a comment. There's people that feel like they need to leave a comment for every video that I make. You don't have to. Anyways, got that out of the way. Vince better be scared. He better be. And the soccer moms can suck it.